What's going on everybody? Jose Guzman here, GuzmanBoardsAndAgus.com, coming right back at you with another quick update. Today's update is going to be um, the moving of these three does into our kitting pen. So we do have these three does who should be kitting here within the next month. As you guys can see, the black um, and white dapple is heavily uttered. She should be kitting here within the next week, a uh, week and a half maybe, and then there's this light colored a doe shouldn't be that much longer as well. The dark colored doe, um, the one in the center of the screen here, she is just starting to get another. So she should be uh, probably about maybe a month out or so. But I went ahead, I went ahead and separated these guys um, just because when they are this close to um, kidding, I'd rather have a close eye on them. And I definitely do not want to separate just one. Uh, when I do these separations, I do want to separate two to three uh, that way, um, one of them is not just lonely and uh, constantly just trying to trying to get out. Uh, having two to three kind of kind of um, calms them down a little bit. Um, so all three of these goats are registered. Um, this black and white one, uh, she is about two years old. She has never kidded before. It's gonna be her first kidding. She is registered, I believe, ninety three percent. And these two um, brown dapples are both gonna be 100% registered. So all three of these um, are bred to the Black Dapple Buck Mooney that you guys saw a little bit, little while ago there. Uh, he is in the pen right next to him. Uh, he is registered 89. So all of these kids uh, will, will be uh, potentially registered depending on how, how good they turn out. Um, so that being said, like I said, my process is I do separate them as soon as they're starting to show utter. That dark brown dapple, the only reason I separated her is because these two dappled does, uh, they're kind of a unit. Um, they kind of do everything together. So I don't want to separate just one of them. Went ahead and I separated uh, both of them. Uh, plus, plus is that they will be together. Downside is that the brown, uh, the head, the dark brown one is a little bit more aggressive. Uh, so she does bully this black one a little bit. Uh, both the brown dapples um, are pushing three years old. Uh, this little black dapple is pushing two years old. So they are a little bit bigger. Uh, they do move her around a little bit. Um, as, you, as you guys can see here, they, they kind of excluded her. But I do have feed on all on three different corners. As you guys can see here, I do have this feeder um, that uh, they do have access to. And on here, I do want to show I do have full access to cameras. Uh, so I do have one camera there uh, in case someone, one of them kids. Um, I know exactly when it happens. And I do also have an outside camera um, watching them on the outside as well. So hope you guys enjoyed. Like I said, stay tuned. Should be having some more kids here hit the ground within another week, maybe two. And I'll definitely keep you guys updated on that. Don't forget to check out our website, goosenboardsandangus.com. And I'll catch you guys on the next one. Appreciate it.